Would you be my girlfriend? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be giving you guys a list of foods to eat to grow your breasts. There is a really big common misconception that, you know, what you eat doesn't have an effect on your body or, you know, it all depends on your genetics. And I'm here to tell you guys that is completely not true. I've noticed when I switched my diet, my body fat distribution has really changed. So I'm gonna get to the list of foods in a second, but before we get to this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe and let's go. So first, almond milk, cashew milk, walnut milk, the nut family is, oh my God, like guys, I've noticed that ever since I've been drinking almond milk for the past few years, like walnut milk, all types of like nut milk, they they definitely they definitely helped. Okay, <laughs> that's all I can say. And my next one is mixed nuts, y'all. Brazilian nuts, cashews, almonds. Um, oh my god, like. Pretty much if you eat any type of mixed nuts, get it in the package, it's gonna say mixed nuts on it, in the grocery store, just pop it in your mouth, y'all. Like, nope, wait, that sounded, that, that, I feel like that didn't go together. But <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say, like, trust me, mixed nuts definitely help, and they're so easy, like, just to pop in your mouth when you're, you know, at work, or, you know, you're coming from the gym, or you're in class. It's a very convenient, healthy snack. My next one is fenugreek seeds. Fenugreek seeds are so, so essential if you want to see breast growth. There's so many women on YouTube or even outside of YouTube that said that they have taken fenugreek for a month and they've seen results. They put in their tea, they put in their cereal, like fenugreek seeds definitely helps y'all. Flax seeds, flax seeds is my best friend. Flax seeds, flax oil. The flax family is a really healthy estrogenic food and it's actually really good for digestion. I always talk to you guys about digestion because having a good gut, having good digestion is room to just having a healthy body in general. So flax seeds are really, really, really loaded with good estrogen. Yeah, you could just toss it in your oatmeal in the morning. You could put it on top of your bread, sprinkle it on your cereal. You know, flax seeds is, is the truth. <laughs> flax seeds has been with me for a little while, so you know, I love it. And nut butter, nut butter is so nice and so tasty. <laughs> I actually am like trying to stay away from it. You, I will say that if you're trying to like lose weight, probably don't take nut butter because it's, it's like, it's pretty fattening, I think. Yeah, it's pretty fattening. So stay away from nut butter if you're trying to lose weight. But if you're not, girl, nut butter is so good. Um, I like Justine's. Justine's is, is really nice, especially on top of like some cinnamon bread. So that'd be a really good, you know, um, breakfast in the morning. And then my next one is strawberries, cranberries, blueberries, blackberry, basically the berry family, y'all. Like the berry family is filled with antioxidants, really nice, healthy estrogen. Like the berry family is tasty as hell and it's a go. <laughs> um, my next one is papaya. Papaya is used, it's very, it's a really nice exotic fruit. Like it's used all over the world. So, so nice. Papaya has really good healthy estrogen. It's good actually for your skin too, but um, yeah, like papaya is a nice food and it definitely helps. It helps y'all, trust me, it helps. All right. And then now apples, plums, yeah, apples, plums, trust me, like that would definitely help. Apricots, peaches, now apricots and peaches are great. You can consume it dried or you can also consume it fresh. Probably better fresh, reason being is because typically when you buy like dried fruit, they have sugar. They usually put it like syrups or they put like cane sugar, things like that. So I would stay away from dried fruit if you're trying to reduce your sugar intake. But dried fruit has 
really good nice healthy estrogen so i but like i said i would just recommend to just take you know the fresh one and then wild yam regular yam y'all just a secret wild yam and regular yam like really just creates curves in your in your body so put some yam in your stews your soups you'll love it okay carrots oh wow so carrots are so nice um because mainly like carrots take away the toxic you know estrogen in your body when we eat a lot of genetically modified foods we consume xenoestrogens so carrots like make sure that's raw though raw carrots help take away the, the bad estrogen and just regulates your estrogen level good so yeah y'all i'm gonna keep doing dances in this video so don't mind me <laughs> um wine wine red wine guys red wine if you're underage do not drink wine if you're watching this no wine is not you cannot do that but but wine definitely helps wine has really good properties for your heart um it really it has good just overall good properties in general so i think wine and dark chocolate has the same properties so, yes red wine fennel 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 all right so fennel i think a lot of you guys should know fennel is like a really good food if you want to increase your breast size yeah i'm sorry i just keep on like you know because yeah but <laughs> fennel is is really really nice what you want to do is put the fennel seeds in some water soak it and then drink the residual and trust me y'all will see results um i've said this a hundred times on my channel salmon 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 mussels the whole like seafood family salmon is a really high omega-3 salmon is something that you want to eat in general it's good for your brain health you want to consume walnuts salmon those are really good high omega-3 foods and like prawns for example mackerel shrimp shrimp y'all um beans beans black-eyed peas the beans and peas family has lots of healthy estrogen so pair it with some nice brown rice put a little bit of you know shrimp saute it like you guys got a good breast growth meal right there olive oil okay so this is very very important if you're eating um canola oil vegetable oil corn oil all types of bad oil make sure today you throw that out if you haven't learned anything from my channel olive oil is basically your best friend if you want you know just a healthy body but also breast growth as well so make sure that you know you definitely switch to olive oil cold pressed organic extra virgin olive oil that is super important a lot of olive oils out here it's very fake so if it doesn't say extra virgin, if it doesn't say organic, if it's not cold pressed, it's probably not real. Pay that extra dollar, okay? It's super duper important. And last but not least, avocado. Avocado was literally listed the world's most healthiest food. I, or it's at least amongst one of them. So avocado is so essential. It's such a nice high omega-3 fat, just like your salmon, your olive oil, all that. It's part of that fat family. Um, it, it reduces inflammation. It's it, it just, oh my God, like it keeps your skin glowing. Um, it has healthy estrogen, like to help, you know, your girl sit up. Like avocado is something you want to eat every single day, y'all. Almost, at least every day almost every day okay okay so if you're eating like eggs or anything the best swap is avocado you could put it over your toast you could put it on your salad you can eat it on the side of literally anything avocado is so important so those are my list of 20 foods i hope you guys enjoyed this video sound off on the comments below let me know dishes that you're going to eat that you're going to put together like 
let's let's help each other out like creative dishes that you're going to eat monday through friday breakfast lunch and dinner that you could put together with these list of foods that i mentioned and we're all gonna grow together y'all trust me this really helps like i y'all i was i was like a lot now she's she's sitting up so i'm just i'm really happy and i just wanted to share this video with you guys i hope you guys liked it so if you guys like this video be sure to hit that like button and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one Girl, you should be my girl.